Hey everybody, welcome back to Subnautica. Sorry if I sound a little bit funny, I'm sick. Got a sinus thing, gotta love that. I'm gonna pull out some glass and some titanium. Because I want to build onto my base a bit. Some I was uh, I was told in between recordings is that you actually move faster when you have oh hello when you have items put away which is something I didn't know so you know something good for me to know I guess and then I'm gonna build on another one of where'd it go one of you I got some titanium in my free time in between episodes just. So I wouldn't have to waste a bunch of time looking for it. Looking pretty good. Wow. I actually want to try something real quick. It's straight up a I'm gonna straight up attach you like that, that works. And now for part of my master plan. I'm gonna build a large aquarium. If I can There we go. And then all I gotta do is throw a hatch on. Out of titanium. Lovely. Do I have any more in here? I have to. Oh, I need glass. Boy. Another thing I did in between was I put a little beacon right above my base so I know exactly where it is at all times. Because when I was doing a little bit of testing before my actual recordings. I had had my my first base right above this, but this thing started drifting away. So I was like, "Well, lovely." It started like moving. This is not good for me. And then we're gonna build some glass. Well, like I was saying, you can apparently move swim somewhat faster when you put your thing away. Or at least that's what I was told. I have to assume it's true. Ooh, I found some salt. Thank you up. Got my first mean comment the other day. It was for my Slime Rancher video. I posted it up, and somebody posted something along the lines of, uh, don't mean to be rude, but I have to dislike this, and honestly, this video is crap. And anybody who saw my videos would agree. And something along the lines of, my time is more important than yours, don't waste it next time. I was like, wow, that's pretty rude, you know, and it kind of made me feel bad at first, and then I was like, do they really think their videos are that much better? So I went to their channel, and the only video they had up, they had a single video up on their channel, and it was like a three minute clip from some anime. I was like, you know what, I don't feel bad anymore. This person's just a giant dick trolling around being a dick for the sake of being a dick. Of course, I really shouldn't care what people think in the first place, because if I do, then I'm just bound to fail. I'm not gonna be able to make everybody on the internet happy. Hello, little air sack. How are you? Or I finish you. Aha. There we go. Now I can go catch me some fishy fishes and throw them on in. Keepers. I want some air sacs so I can use them for both food and water. Which is perfect because I have like fucking five of them right here. 
get you. And you. I also need to do better about keeping my eye on my oxygen. So I don't die or nearly die. Like I didn't did in the last episode. Come here, little fishy. Come here, fishy, 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 fishy. Hey, quit swimming. I think that's... Oh, here's one. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Here, fishy. I'm bad at grabbing fish in this game. <laughs> nice thing about the aquarium is that you can take fish if you have a fish of the same kind here. Right click to drop. Oh, well, I'm an idiot. I just ate all those fish. Oh, <laughs> uh, great. Oh, I'm sure the comment section will love that one. Now I'm gonna need to use so I can make bleach. That was a perfectly good waste of air sacks. <laughs> I better start hunting some more. Hey, fish, bastard, get back here. Maybe. It'd be nice to find some more. Kind of unlucky for me that I did a dumb, did a stupid thing and ate them all. New creature discovered. Emergency. Seismic readings suggest a quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The central dark matter reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus 10, 9, ooh, 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 8. Ooh. This is what I've been waiting for. Six, five, four, three, two, Happy New Year! That's a pretty nice explosion, though. You got it, man. Aha! Okay, now where's my seconds? I also trying to want to try to go hunting for some. Hunting for some of the fragment parts since I have the scanner. And I should be able to find. I might be able to find some here in this area. Oh yeah, stalker tooth, sweet. I'm gonna need those for enamel glass later on. They can be kind of a pain in the butt to find. Found a dark spot. I need to remember to keep my eye on my oxygen, too. Finding silver, which is nice. I'll need some of that later on. Oh, sweet. Another stock, too. Yeah. Oh, damn. Two. Two stalker teeth. This is already going way better than last time. Sweet. Stasis rifle. You're one of the ones I wanted to find. I need to scan this, and I need to go back up real quick. Warning, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another fish I'd really like to find are, um, it's called a Reginald. It's supposed to give a really good, like a really big amount of food. Oh, sweet, more sacks. I mean, I could not screw it up this time. I'm gonna grab you, and you, and you, and you. And you. Come on. Come here, little buddy. I'm not gonna hurt you yet. Yeah, get back here. Get back here. Oh, sweet, another fragment. See him off, sweet. I'd like to get one of you made at some point. Be able to get around the place faster. I have two of the pieces. This is the tunnel I was talking about. There's tons and tons of 
uh, limestone in there. Yep, I'm rolling. There's that. I want to grab, make sure I grab a few extra so I can turn them into water and food now while the other ones start breeding. And then I want to build a fabrication station. Ooh, salt. I want to build a fabricator and some solar power in my base so that I don't have to keep going back and forth between my base and the little uh, escape pod. Make things look faster on it. Yeah, I need, I need to do a much better job of job of uh, 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 I can speak today. Much better job of keeping an eye on my oxygen. I'm pretty bad about that right now. Welcome aboard, Captain. For some reason, this game kind of makes me think of One Piece. It's an anime about pirates, and I think the reason it makes me think about One Piece makes me think about this makes me think about One Piece is the fact that in One Piece, in this world, it's mainly ocean except for like islands here and there i haven't found any of the islands islands yet but i'd like to find one or two of them uh, later on how do i build a fabricator your seamoth dang here we go all day is two titanium which is great i'm gonna throw you right there What do I need for solar panels? Two titanium, one quartz. I also need to be, get better about picking up quartz when I see it and not being too worried about filling up my inventory. I can keep an eye out for it while I head over here so I can turn that scrap metal that I picked up into, that tit into titanium. I want to build at least two solar panels. Maybe three would be nice. So I can keep my fabricator for the most part powered. Well, it seems like with my luck, usually whenever I need to use a fabricator is when... Be like during the night time when the solar panels aren't working because obviously it's night there's some quartz like one of the like the main differences i'd say between this world and one piece is that in one piece um it's a major ma majority of it is islands but there's one strip of land that goes completely around the earth called the red line and then Perpendicular to that is a uh, strip of ocean called the Grand Line. One Piece is honestly one of my favorite animes. If you're a fan of anime, I'd honestly recommend checking it out. It's a pretty good one. I'm gonna keep my distance from you, you little crazy butt munch. Perfect. Now I can head. Uh, hello. Going away from you. And they both have sea monsters. Well, these are more sea aliens than monsters, but, well, that, yeah, I guess you could call them sea monsters. I mean, best thing to call them, right? I think the best place to build, it'd probably be like right on top of that, if I can build there. I should be able to, and they should reach my base. Solar panel. Yep, and it reaches my base. You're like glitched into it, but at this point, I don't really care as long as you work. Of course, that's starting to get nighttime, so. I had a beeping going. I was like, what the fuck is that? 
And then I remembered that I had a timer set for this, so I'm gonna do a few more things, and I'm gonna leave the episode here, and then I'll probably go like searching for some stuff in my free time, or in between episodes, probably. Just so I can make things a little bit easier on me. Oh my god. Resources, basics. I should have enough to do you. Perfect. I think I have enough. I, I don't know. Let's see real quick. Nope, I'm short one quartz. Aha, sweet. <laughs> Glitchy. I'll tell you, being sick really sucks. I, I have a sinus uh, cold, whatever you call it right now, and honestly, I think I prefer like being sick, like throwing up over this. I know some people might be like, Trenton, that just sounds crazy. I'd much rather have a sinus thing than throwing up, but like me personally, when like I get sick to the point of like throwing up, I'm usually like you know throwing up for the first couple hours that I'm sick, and then after that, I'm perfectly fine. Like I might have a slightly upset stomach, but other than that, I'm perfect. Well, guys, I'm going to go on ahead and leave this episode here. I think I'm going to maybe go hunting for some fragments in the shallows, which is the spawn area, as well as the creep vine forest. And uh, I'll go on and keep recording in case I find anything really cool. You know, throw it on uh, maybe like at the end of the episode or something. But uh, thank you, thanks everybody so much for watching. Be sure to uh, hit that like button, comment, and or subscribe. Uh, let me know what you thought. Thanks, guys. I'll see you later. Woo!